Okay, so I am here with a few of the Dome books. I will be showing, this is a different kind of video. This is, I believe, my first video of the new year. So, just a different kind of video. I have Doom, House of Traders, Volume 1, like Special Edition. I have Doom, House of Traders, Volume 2. I have Frank Herbert's Doom, the graphic novel book 1. And I just have, I have the whole set, but I have all of the Doom novels. So, just a quick video. I just wanted to uh, talk to you guys uh, a little bit. And uh, I'll, sh I'll be showing these books as well. Uh, I know it's been a while since I've done a video, but that's going to change. I'm going to try to do a video a day and see how that goes. I had I wanted to show some books, but I didn't get them in time. So that kind of uh, it kind of, it, it kind of made me uh, a little uh, not upset, but uh, I was kind of down about it because I wanted to get it out there. But I'll go ahead and go into these, and we'll go from there. One second while I transition the camera. Okay, so I'll be going into the Doom House of Trades Volume 1 by Brian Herbert. With everything that was going on with the film and just wanted to cover it briefly. Yeah, I got, uh, was kind of upset that I didn't get certain books ahead of time because I wanted um had some things go wrong with my order and I wasn't able to get them one second in a timely manner to show them I still will show them but I'm still waiting on one in particular that I really wanted to show I like I, I like stories outside of like the normal. Like I I like I've said before that I like superhero like comics now, but they slowly had to grow on me. Like I wasn't really into like Spider Man and, and, and Batman and I had a few but it's how would you say I've seen things to where I need stories a little bit darker. And I like stories outside of some of the stuff. Like uh, the normal, you know, the top 10 or top 5 or whatever. You know, we keep getting the same. Just a different retake and different takes on stories. So, it's the back of that. It, it depends on the author to, you know, create the story. This is Doom, House of Trades, Volume 2, to make the different stories. But I like stories outside of, like, the, uh, like Avengers and, you know. So, I prefer, like, Doom and, like, uh, Annihilation. Sandman, American Gods, you know, Watchmen, stuff, not just like Batman, Superman, and like I got the Green Lanterns, the Longbow editions, one and two, I'll be showing that in the next video, so that will be coming soon, and I'll show one at a time, one thing that I've been doing is I've been showing multiple multiple videos in like a short time frame i'm going to show certain i'm just going to pick and choose what i show now i want to say thank you for the people that have subscribed i truly appreciate it this is dumb not everybody is into it like i found out that majority of the things come from Dome, 
such as like Star Wars and uh, what's the other one? The Fifth Element. So majority of the things started with Dome. This was the basis for almost everything. So it's kind of hard not to like it. Go ahead and I'll show you the bat. Unless you just don't like, like space uh, drama, space opera. This one was not too good. But I'm the person where I bought this format. I have to continue in this format. I don't want I don't like to change formats. The binding for this was really tight and it wasn't it was just too tight. So it made the book flex. They released another one with the slip case. It's really this exact same book, just a bigger, better copy. So, Frank Herbert, so adopted by Brian Herbert and Kevin J. Anderson. Acknowledgements. Like this artwork is not as good as what you've just seen in the previous two. It's not a glossy, it's like a like a matte. So that's where you're not getting all of the glare from the light. So go ahead and show a bit of this. I know some other YouTubers have showed different things, so show different videos and different things about Doom that have gone into, you know, a lot more detail. Because I'm fairly new to Doom. I'm not I I I got into it within like the last like two years. to see I heard it was one guy he was in a uh, shop talking about I went in there looking for Neil Gaiman stuff and he was like you know he really doesn't do comics like that anymore he just does like uh, novels and I'm like well majority of novels they get turned into comics American Gods and uh, I think there's another one, Chivalry, the um, Graveyard Book, Coraline. Those all were novels, and then they got adapted into being graphic novels. So, especially with Norse mythology. Norse mythology was a novel first, and then here comes the comic. So, go ahead. And the last one... Yeah, this one, they had problems with it. Like, the binding, it wasn't too good. And I'll go ahead and I'll take this off. And it's literally the exact same book. It's just a smaller version. Well, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, I want to thank the people that have commented liked you know and shared the videos i truly appreciate it and once again i'm red thank you for watching and you have a great day have a great day